Welcome back to my channel. Uh, in today's video, I'm going to show you some outfit inspo uh, to wear to work and sort of how to spice up your office attire. Um, obviously, the dress code varies in different work environments. Uh, in some workplaces, you have to stick to business formal and in some, it's more relaxed or you can dress however you like. I work in an office where we have to dress professionally but not quite business formal. So this lookbook is uh, more of a business casual, semi-formal type of dress code. I know it's hard to dress up every day and I am totally guilty of it too uh, because I guess some days you're just not feeling it. But when you do feel like it, I hope this lookbook is helpful and I hope it gives you some inspiration on how to make your work outfits more fun and stylish. So without further ado, let's get to it. For the first outfit, I picked out this uh, midi, almost maxi dress uh, and wore it with some yellow block heels. We all know that we have to wear a dress that past your knees, uh, but the funny thing is I don't think I ever wore a maxi dress to work. So this dress is definitely fresh to the eyes and uh, it's totally appropriate for work. It has collar and long sleeves and it covers pretty much all your legs. I think this floral print is also perfect. It's not overwhelming, but you know, still very eye-catching. Uh, for work shoes, uh, beside pumps, uh, I usually wear um, block heel sandals because they are easy and quite comfortable. I decided to go for a little bolder choice with the yellow uh, neon color. If you think the dress is fun enough, you can always just stick with uh, some black or nude heels. Moving on to the second outfit, uh, I want to add some twists to um, a shirt and midi skirt combo uh, so for the shirt i opted for a plain satin shirt um, i think this material is beautiful and it is definitely something unexpected for work outfits uh, because when we think of satin we usually think of uh, intimate pajama wear uh, and it can be a little bit difficult to pull off in the office but i wanted to give it a try so i did 
I paired it with a midi pencil skirt and instead of a black pencil skirt, I opt for one with check print. I promise it's all about the little details that elevate a look. To complete the look, I uh, picked out some white sling back heels um, since there were quite a bit going on with the top and the skirt. Um, I just want the third item of the outfit to be uh, somewhat simple. These shoes are probably in my top three favorite pairs of shoes in my closet. I'm obsessed with the feet though. I just think it's so elegant and feminine and classy. So besides playing with material, adding print and small details to your outfits, uh, another thing you can do is adding accessories. Uh, for work, I would definitely opt for some dainty jewelry because they just look more expensive than the statement kind. Uh, they can do a lot when it comes to elevating your workwear. And it doesn't have to be anything complicated. Um, for example, on a day when you have your hair in an updo, you can just put on some earrings and they'll make a difference. Uh, in this video, I wore a necklace from an online diamond jewelry store called Fascinating Diamonds. Uh, they have a ton of options for customize my jewelry so you should definitely check it out they actually sent me this necklace and i am totally in love uh, so thank you so much fascinating diamond you probably saw it in the video already but i also want to give you a closer look anyways so this is the box this comes in when you open it this is a little light so you can see the diamond shine and bling and who doesn't like that right I also have a promo code that I will put in the description box um, in case you want to buy something from their site. Third outfit is a look with some wide leg pants. Um, I feel like flare trousers are such a closet staple for anyone who has a 9 to 5 office job at some point in their life or even for those who doesn't. The ones I had on this video is uh, with a modern touch to it um, with a shape and the stripe prints uh, just simple details but they just make the pants look younger and more stylish i feel like moving on to another staple of work outfits which is the blue shirt i picked out this blue blouse i just like um adding small little details and a little twist to a classic clothing item um, I think the color goes very well with the blue stripe on the pants and it's really tied the whole outfit together. For shoes, honestly, you do not have to worry so much about it because the pants cover it anyways. Um, I wore some white mules with my outfit, but if mules are not appropriate for your work dress code, uh, you can always go for some pumps. <clears throat> Alright, we are at the last outfit and on this one, I cannot help it but let my obsession for ruffles take control. So I had on some black pants that then you get to the bottom, there's all these ruffle hems. I promise you these little details are what make a huge difference and turn a basic plain outfit into a very stylish look. To brighten up the look, um, I opted for a pink shirt. Uh, the funny thing is I used to not like to wear pink in high school and college, but the other day, I just browsed my Instagram feed and I realized there was so much pain going on. If you haven't followed me on Instagram, please find me on there. My IG handle is by Emily, or you can click the link down below where I listed all my social media. You'll see more pictures of outfits, OOTD, cute clothes, flat lace, so go find me on there. Follow me. Back to the outfit. Uh, for shoes, I wanted to go for some pumps because that's what we wear to work. I have these polka dots pumps for Aldo for like a year now and I love them. I think they are a great choice when I want to be somewhere between classic and trendy and fashion forward. Alright guys, that is all for today's video. Um, I hope you guys enjoy and get some inspiration uh, for your work outfits and while your co-workers. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for my new videos. Thank you so much for watching, so I'll see you next time. Bye! Hello guys!